Once upon a time, in a kingdom far beneath the ocean's surface, there was a world like no other. This was not a kingdom of stone and steel, but one of glistening coral and shimmering seaweed. The inhabitants were not humans or animals as we know them, but mystical creatures of the sea, each more enchanting than the last. Dancing seahorses, singing clams, and playful dolphins all called this magical place home. In the heart of this kingdom lived a young mermaid named Coral. Coral was not your ordinary mermaid. She was known far and wide for her vibrant red hair, a color as vivid as the coral she was named after. But it wasn't just her striking appearance that set her apart. Coral was known for her adventurous spirit. She was always ready for an adventure, always curious, always eager to explore the vast kingdom and beyond. Coral had a special place in the kingdom. Her laughter echoed through the water, her songs charmed even the grumpiest of sea turtles, and her stories of adventure inspired the young and old alike. But even for Coral, there was so much more to discover, so much more to explore. With a heart full of curiosity, Coral set off on her greatest adventure yet. As Coral swam deeper into the ocean, a mysterious sea cave appeared before her. The sea cave was like nothing Coral had ever seen before. It was vast and seemingly endless, with walls that shimmered with a thousand different colors, reflecting the light that filtered down from the surface. The entrance was wide and inviting, but also held a sense of foreboding that made Coral's heart flutter with both excitement and fear. As she ventured further into the cave, she felt the water temperature drop and the currents become more unpredictable. She had to navigate through a maze of stalactites and stalagmites, some so sharp that they appeared like teeth in the dim light. There were moments where she had to squeeze through tight passages, her little fins trembling with effort. But Coral was not deterred. She was, after all, a brave little fish with a heart full of courage. She had heard stories of the treasures that lay hidden in these caves, and she was determined to find them. So she pressed on, her eyes wide with wonder and determination. The deeper she went, the more fascinating creatures she came across. She saw bioluminescent fish that lit up the dark corners of the cave, their bodies glowing like stars in the night sky. She saw crabs scuttling across the seafloor, their shells adorned with precious gems. She even saw a giant squid, its enormous eyes watching her curiously as she swam past. There were moments when the fear threatened to overwhelm her. The darkness seemed too vast, the silence too deafening, but Coral reminded herself of why she was there. She thought of the magical treasures that could be waiting for her, the wonders that she could bring back to her kingdom. And so, with a deep breath and a final surge of courage, Coral swam on. The darkness gave way to a soft golden glow. As she swam closer, she saw it, a massive treasure chest overflowing with gold and precious gems. It was more beautiful than anything she could have ever imagined. With her heart pounding, Coral slowly opened the treasure chest. The sight that met her eyes was beyond anything she had ever imagined. Nestled within the old worn chest was the most beautiful pearl she had ever seen. It seemed to emit a soft, ethereal glow, casting a magical aura around the murky cave. This was no ordinary pearl. It was the legendary enchanted pearl, a treasure believed to have been lost to the sands of time. The tales of old had spoken of its magical power, the power to grant a single wish to the one who discovered it. As Coral held the pearl in her hands, she could feel its energy pulsating, as if it was alive. The enormity of the situation dawned on her. She had in her hands the power to wish for anything her heart desired. She could wish for a life of luxury and comfort, far away from the dangers of the ocean. She could wish for endless riches, more than she could ever dream of. But as she thought of her kingdom, her people, and the struggles they faced every day, she knew what she had to do. Her kingdom had been suffering for years under the harsh rule of the sea witch, the once vibrant and bustling underwater city was now just a shadow of its former self. The people lived in fear, their spirits crushed. Coral knew that she had to use her wish to change this. She held the glowing pearl close to her heart, closed her eyes, and focused all her thoughts on her kingdom and her people. 
She wished for the sea witch's rule to end and for peace and prosperity to return to her kingdom. She wished for the laughter and joy of her people to fill the ocean once again. The pearl pulsed in her hand, its glow brightening for a moment before fading away. As the light from the pearl dimmed, Coral felt a surge of hope. She had made her wish, the wish for the betterment of her kingdom. With a hopeful heart, Coral made her wish. When Coral returned to her kingdom, she was greeted with an incredible sight. The previously dim and desolate underwater realm, once home to despair and gloom, was now awash with vibrant colors and dazzling light. The transformation was miraculous. The coral reefs, once on the brink of extinction, now bloomed with life, their colors brighter and more varied than ever before. Schools of fish, large and small, darted among the reefs, their scales shimmering like precious jewels under the gentle sway of the ocean's currents. The once barren seabed now teemed with lush sea plants, their leaves swaying rhythmically to the ocean's lullaby. But it wasn't just the physical landscape that had undergone a transformation. The atmosphere of the kingdom had changed too. The sense of despair that once clouded the kingdom had evaporated, replaced with a newfound sense of joy and hope. The marine creatures, previously forlorn and despondent, were now filled with happiness, their faces glowing with delight and contentment. And at the heart of it all was Coral, our selfless heroine. Her wish had not been for herself, but for the prosperity and happiness of her kingdom. Her selflessness had brought about this incredible transformation, turning their underwater world into a haven of peace and prosperity. Coral became a beloved figure in the kingdom, adored and respected by all. Her kindness, courage, and selflessness had not only saved their world, but had made it a better place. A place where happiness thrived and despair was a distant memory. The kingdom was not just transformed, it was reborn. Reborn into a world of beauty, joy, and harmony. A world that echoed with laughter and resonated with love. A world that was a testament to Coral's bravery and her selfless wish. And so, Coral's brave journey had led to the prosperity of her kingdom. Her story served as a beacon of hope. A reminder to all that even in the face of adversity, selflessness, and courage can bring about a world of change. As the sun set on the transformed kingdom, Coral's story teaches us an important lesson. This tale, my dear friends, is more than just an adventure in a magical underwater kingdom. It's a lesson in bravery, in selflessness, and in using our resources wisely for the benefit of others. Our young heroine, Coral, demonstrated bravery in the face of the unknown. She ventured into the mysterious sea cave, not knowing what she would find, and, despite the fear, she pressed on because she knew her kingdom needed her. She teaches us that real courage is about doing what's right, even when it's scary. Coral also showed us the meaning of selflessness. She found the enchanted treasure, a treasure that could have made her the richest in the kingdom, but she chose to use it to transform her kingdom to make it a better place for everyone. She reminds us that true wealth is not in what we have for ourselves, but in what we do for others. And Coral's wise use of resources, the enchanted treasure, led to the improvement of her entire kingdom. It serves as a reminder that we too have resources at our disposal, and it's up to us how we choose to use them. So, remember just like Coral, we too can make a difference in our world when we choose to be brave and selfless.